everyone, welcome back. Hope you're all having an awesome Thursday. I'm Stacy, and this is the For Bricks and Giggles YouTube channel. I've got a Paradisa set for today's speed build. Set 6414, Dolphin Point from 1995. So stick around to the end to hear my review, and let's get started. So here we have the completed build and this set is right around 200 pieces and comes with four minifigures. And I just have to say I've always loved Paradisa. I don't feel like it got enough sets. I think it was less than 20 sets. Came out between 92 and 97 so it was before I was even old enough to start collecting Lego. So I missed out on all of these as a child and they're incredibly expensive to get now which is really unfortunate i just happened to luck out and get this set for a really good deal probably two or three years ago because when i did look this set up the cheapest one in america was 120 dollars which is insane for a 200 piece set and then i looked it up on ebay as well to see if that was like comparable and there was only one for sale in the US and it was $85 and the base plate was cracked. And so to get the base plate, you're probably gonna be paying 20 plus dollars, maybe even 30 plus dollars. So that still averages out to about $120 for this set. And that's just crazy in my opinion. I do love this set. I love this set. It's a great set. It's a fun build. And I just feel like Paradisa is very classic Lego. And it does have some exclusive or really rare parts in this set as well. But that price, definitely astronomical. So I'll show you the minifigures first. You do get two male minifigures and two female. So really great classic Paradisa minifigures in this set. I love the torso for this one. That Paradisa pink is one of my favorite colors Lego has ever produced. So really great minifigures. I love four is a really good amount of minifigures to get in a set. A lot of playability there. And then it does come with a dolphin. So the dolphin is just in this set and one other set. At least this variation is just in this set and one other set, and that is also the Hurricane Harbor set that came out in 1995 as well. So really cool, love the dolphin, just a great extra animal piece there. And then you do get this really cool crab tile also, and this only came in this set and one other Paradisa set. So a kind of rare or exclusive piece there. The base plate for this set is only in this set. This is the only set this base plate comes in. And like I said, it does go for about 20 to $30 on Bricklink in the US. So kind of expensive there if it's something you're looking for. But it is a really nice island plate, a great variation. The green is that 
medium green color so it's not the same as like the traditional green that you'd see in the pirate sets but still a really cool base plate if you're wanting a beach themed mock build this would be a really cool one to get because it's a little bit different than the other standard green ones i love this lighthouse design i think that's great I think I've done at least one other set that has a staircase like this one, but not a lot of sets have that staircase, so kind of a more rare piece. And then here in the front, we've got like a little picnic table and umbrella. So I'm going to show you closer up the tiles that they have for the plates. So it comes with two of these little plate tiles with different food patterns on them. And these are both exclusive to this set. So we've got one here they're really cute little heart design around the outside of the plate and then a little food pattern on the inside so there are two variations of that and those will run you a few dollars a piece if you are wanting to add those to your collection because they do only come in this set and one of them was missing when I bought this set. I knew the set wasn't guaranteed to be complete, and I think I ended up having to pay about $4 to get that tile to complete this set. But it was in really good condition, so it was totally worth it. Also, for the price that I got it, was very worth it. And it did come with a box, too, which was nice. So I did, I did flatten the box, but I kept the box because I love, you know, doing the designs that I usually have up behind me. So I've been keeping all of the old boxes and any instruction manuals that are in really rough shape so that I can eventually make some more of those. This set also came with some sticker pieces. So on the main floor here, we've got here in the front, two different sticker pieces. So one's like a sign for what kind of ice cream they sell. And the other one has drinks on it. And then there is a little ice cream freezer in the interior here that also has the ice cream patterns on it. So lucking out that these stickers have held up really nicely considering the age of the set. And I do really like those designs. They're really nice. Interior also has a little kitchen on the second floor a little cabinet and a little coffee maker and a coffee cup got a nice pink door some pink fences and then the lighthouse does spin at the top as well so I know they've done some light and sound sets in the past and it would have been really cool to have made this light up I would have loved that I do have a lighthouse that's much more recent that does light up and I think that would be really cool to maybe even just try and maneuver myself at some point and kind of add that light feature to it because I think that would be a really nice addition. And then it does come with a classic palm tree. Always love a good palm tree. Just feels very, you know, 90s Lego. So a lot of great little features. It does have this nice little boat, the sail. I think that's really cute. So only two, 200 pieces, just under 200 actually. Um, so a very quick build. I think I built this in about 20 minutes or so, but it does come with four mini figures and it is a beautiful design. And like I said at the beginning, very expensive, um, unfortunately, to get in America, at least presently, but unfortunately is expensive. But if you are a Paradisa collector, like I am, I definitely recommend checking this set out if you haven't already. Paradisa had a short run. I think there's less than 20 sets. So in the long run, if you're trying to collect all of them, you know, definitely add this one to your list because it's totally worth it. And it's a beautiful set and a great design and a super fun build.
Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, like and subscribe. I post new videos every Monday and Thursday. See you next time. If you'd like a Big Brick Energy t-shirt like the one I'm wearing, go to my webpage link in the description and click the merch button.